a warm fall, but winter is right around the corner. Believe it or not, we've already seen the, some of the colder temperatures. Here to help us prepare for the weather is Weingarts President Dan Weingarts. We've seen your commercials. We know that you guys do power tools, but you guys um, can really help us. Last year, you guys gave us some great tips. We're going to start on this side of the table, and really what you're doing is kind of putting us in that mode, so to speak, right? Yeah, yeah. winter weather happens, right? We're yeah. in Michigan, so it's going to happen. <laughs> and so, you know, it's, it's always important, you know, uh, having backup power is important, so a generator is, is certainly important all times of the year, but in the winter time, it really can become dangerous, you know, where you get cold weather and freezing pipes and everything like that. So we always say if, if you don't have some kind of backup power, look into that and make sure that that's running well. Make sure you get it started before, you know, something happens and a power outage happens and you're not, uh, not ready for it. Say someone has a generator, can they bring it to your store to have it looked at, maybe tuned up, maybe checked out? Absolutely, always. We service everything, uh, all kinds of power equipment, and sure. so we will absolutely be able to hand, help them with that. Perfect. So you also have a saw, too, and we were talking about before we went on the air, really this is paramount because you really need to get that stuff away from your home in case ice gets on the limbs or anything like that. Exactly. You know, that's, you know, um, the, the ice and heavy snow can really uh, put stress on long tree limbs. So if there's things that are hanging over your house, if there are things that are, you know, near power lines, you want to make sure you kind of clear those things away. And uh, different than the blow dryer that the ladies use in the makeup room here, this is um, really can do a number on their hair. I mean, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. And so, we, you know, we talk about, you know, uh, one of the things that I would say this week, maybe even if you haven't had a chance to get the, the leaves out of the gutters um, before the snow and ice come, you want to make sure you get those things out of there. Um, they can really cause problems with ice dams. Um, you know, it, as it freezes in there, and then that can actually lead to flooding in your home. And so, really important to get the leaves out of the gutters, and the uh, blower is a great way to get that done. And Chris was talking about we're going to have some warmer temperatures as we close to 60, so it might be this week the perfect opportunity to do that. And really, we're talking about gas and, and the snow blower too. I mean, gas, a lot of people forget. I, they mowed their grass, they left the gas in the gas tank. What can they do to prevent that from freezing up? So it's really important. Gas only lasts at the maximum about 90 days anymore. With ethanol and fuel, it just doesn't last as long as it used to. So um, run it out. Uh, you know, we always recommend putting in a fuel stabilizer before the end of the season and then abs absolutely run it out of gas and uh, before you store it. And if you've got a snowblower that has old fuel in it, you're going to want to check and make sure that it's going to still run and probably run that old fuel out. And speaking of snowblowers, we know we need one in Michigan. <laughs> and you guys have an array of them. You guys have different types for different budgets, different types of driveways. Take us through the one that you have brought in today. So, so this is what we'd consider just a really compact unit um, designed for small drives. Um, but you're, you're right, Neiman. We've got them you know, from, from this size. Even we've got electric snow, snowblowers all the way up to things that are four foot wide. And so depending on your drive, you really want to make sure. And then, and then make sure it's ready to go. If you do have a snowblower, make sure that uh, you've got it all serviced and that it's ready to, to do the snow, you know, that your paddles are in good shape, that your scraper is in good shape, that the, the oil's changed, that the spark plug's changed, all those kinds of things. Just really important to get ready as we For get ready. For someone that's not like me, they can bring theirs into your store and you can really help them out and <laughs> get them prepared. I'll tell you what, you guys have five locations, right, across yes. the metro? Yes. From you Utica to Farmington Hills. Yes, you got it. And yep. you know what? It's Wine Guards. There you go. There's a location, Farmington Hills, Utica, Clarkston, Ann Arbor, and Cedar Springs. Get prepared for the winter. As you heard Chris mention in his seven first alert forecast, this might be an opportunity to clear out your gutters 